Hi, I'm Dr. Swarchla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. This July, we are conducting a free fertility camp at our Ziva Fertility Centers, Manikonda, Banjara Hills, Sanatnagar and Kompalli. Please do visit. Thank you. Hi, I am Dr. Swarchla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. Is ectopic pregnancy very common with IVF? This is a question patients usually ask when they come to get the procedure done. Ectopic pregnancy is where the fertilized egg implants outside the uterus. It is known risk associated with in vitro fertilization IVF, although the incidence is relatively low. Compared to natural conception, the risk of ectopic pregnancy is slightly higher with IVF due to several factors. Let's look at those factors. There could be some pre-existing conditions. Now in these IVF patients, there may be certain pre-existing conditions that can increase the risk of ectopic pregnancy. These conditions could include a history of pelvic inflammatory disease, PID as we know, endometriosis, previous tubal surgery or infection, or there could be a structural abnormality of the fallopian tubes which could lead to ectopic pregnancy. The next factor that we need to talk about are tubal factors. In IVF, fertilization usually occurs in the laboratory and the resulting embryos are transferred to the uterus. However, in rare cases, an embryo may implant in the fallopian tubes instead of the uterus. This can happen if the tubes are damaged, blocked or if there is an anatomical abnormality as in the shape is not what it should be. Then there is the complication of multiple embryo transfers. To increase the chance of success, IVF sometimes involves transferring more than one embryo to the uterus. This increases the overall pregnancy rate but also slightly elevates the risk of ectopic pregnancy. When multiple embryos are transferred, there is a higher chance that one or more embryos may implant outside the uterus. Fertility clinics usually take precautions to minimize the risk of ectopic pregnancy during IVF. This includes careful monitoring of patients, evaluating the condition of the fallopian tubes, considering individual risk factors, and in addition to this, advancement in ultrasonography or ultrasound technology and early pregnancy monitoring allow for early detection and appropriate management of ectopic pregnancies. If you are undergoing IVF or are considering it, your fertility specialist will discuss all the potential risks including the risk of ectopic pregnancy with you and develop a treatment plan which will help you progress throughout the process and ensure the best possible outcomes which will decrease or minimize the risk of complications including ectopic pregnancy. If you wish to know more about this, please feel free to contact us. Thank you. A lot of effort has gone into making this video. Please like and subscribe us. Thank you.